Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do a love reading. So this is a timeless love reading. So if it resonates with you, it resonates. If it doesn't, it's okay. All right. So um, thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Please continue to do so. Let's go ahead and jump into the reading. Okay, so this card is for how the person that you're coming to the reading for, how they feel about the connection. This is the advice for the relationship, the connection, the friendship, and this is how you feel, Gemini, in regards to uh, the connection. All right. So, um, firstly, there might be some opposition in regard in petty squabbles in regards to you know a, you and a significant other. It's like you both have competing goals. It's not to where you see eye to eye. It's you want to do this, the other person wants to do that. Uh, and, and somebody's very rigid in how they they come off in the relationship. They're not willing to budge on certain things. Gemini, um, you know this. And maybe you've dealt with it for years or, or a great amount of time. So you, you feel like you you have to accept it because you have you have already um, been accepting it. So it, it it would be different for you to no longer accept whatever this person is giving you or feeding you or it's like they just want it their way and, and no other way. This could be a marriage or a long relationship, a long standing relationship, committed relationship. To where now the, the the petty squabbles they they have root and it brings about drama in the relationship also it could be someone also coming into the relationship and and, and, and stirring up and causing confusion it's it's almost as if you guys don't know who you're fighting against or who you're or what you're fighting for it's just a lot of um chaotic energy okay so how your person feels about the connection judgment yeah they they feel like they need to render some judgment either either they're in or they're out um they feel like they need to speak some truth to you and let you know where they stand they feel like they know that they can't live in the past that they have to live right here right now in the present whatever that may be or however they feel about it and they this is the person who understands that change is coming or it, or it has already come uh, but they have to be definite sure about if they are in or if they're out how you feel about the connection Gemini is the seven of swords in the four of wands so you feel like either you will, you feel like either you or the other party is you could be dealing with a cancer you could be dealing with Aries Sagittarius Leo you you could feel like there could be people inside of your home who live in the home with you and they're causing a lot of problems or there's someone who visits the home and they cause a lot of confusion a lot of chaos a lot of drama um they're very childish childish games are being played here um, you feel like you have to not you can't always show how you feel you also feel like you can't let the right hand know what the left hand is doing or vice versa you have you feel like you have you're in this by yourself um, you feel like you had a plan of maybe moving in together moving the relationship along getting engaged or something of that nature but now you feel like you need to revise whatever plan you had made up in your head or in your heart and your emotions maybe even what you talked about with your partner you feel like you need to um, hold something back some of you could be holding something back in regards to the relationship the marriage the business you could be storing away money or something about the home and children and motherly energy 
You could be keeping something from your partner. The advice here is the Knight of Wands. Wow. Um, this is move. This is a move. This is movement. It's fast movement. It's the opportunity that presents itself. And then you have to take necessary action. This could also be you energetically, you know, you taking yourself out of the this relationship energetically, not putting any more energy, time, effort into it because you're not getting what you, you want out of it. Uh, this card is telling you to move. Um, seek out better opportunities. Seek out better people. Seek out help. Um, doesn't look as if it's getting any better. It might get to a place where you're you're at your end. You're at you, um, you're at a place of contemplating. Do you end it or do you stay? It looks like two people on the fence here, but ready to get off the fence. Most definitely. You could be hiding something in, in the home or hiding something in this relationship or somebody's hiding something. There's a lot of sneaky behavior activity going on. It's you, Gemini, or it's the other person. Gemini, I have a really good month of March. Um, this is a timeless read. The advice here is for you to move, move, take action. Whatever comes after that is what comes after it. But it looks as if you know what necessary action you need to take, uh, but you need to take it. Gemini, if you feel like this reading resonated with you, before you go over to the website, book your own reading there. Make sure you're taking advantage of the coupon codes below. Also, um, if you just have a question or two, you can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question on your mobile device. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. Take advantage of that. Thank you and take care, Gemini.